Kane Thompson Summer, welcome to Viking Football. Club. Can I check first, are you coming on loan? Um, yeah, uh, initially it's a loan deal until January. Until January. It'll be reviewed at January. Yeah. Right, okay. And uh, where are you at the base at the moment? Um, I'm at Birmingham City and I've been there for four years now since I was 16 and left school. Right. Because you're a North London boy, aren't you? Yeah, originally I'm from North London, went to school here, grew up here. And then as soon as I finished school, I moved up to Birmingham. So. Yeah, that was very brave. We'll come back to that in a moment. But I want to take you right back. What can you tell me about Jack Wilshire's NCFA Leeds? Oh, I can tell you that um, back in the day when I used to play um, for my Sunday League team, I used to play for Barnet and Zuri, based in Barnet in North London. Um, it was also supported by... Um, the NCF elites and Jack Wilshire was he used to um, support that as well and he would give us all support and I remember when I was young he used to be I'm a big Arsenal fan as well so um, he used to be my idol and I you're a big Arsenal him. fan yeah. I'm sorry to interrupt yeah people will Imagine. understand why I've interrupted uh, in a minute yeah sorry um yeah so he supported it and I got to meet him when I was I think maybe 10 or 11 at the time and at this time he was breaking through so he was like a yeah. big inspiration for me playing midfield as well right yeah so you took that imp inspiration yeah. and you moved on from NCF Elite to where? I moved to Tottenham. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> was, how, how difficult was that? Uh, at the time it was difficult, but not too difficult because even though I was young, I did support Arsenal. I was more yeah. focused on going to the right place for me, football. Like, yeah. And when I went there, I knew that it was a good place for me to be football-wise and stuff like that. Right. And you, were, as you say, you were there till you were 16. And uh, were you released or did Birmingham um, yeah. come for you? Or? No, I was released at 16 from Tottenham. Right. And I didn't really find my feet there. So I wasn't really happy there. So it was kind of the best thing for me because I thought when I left, I got back to like, enjoying my football game, playing in my preferred position. So I think it was the best thing for everyone. Really. And how did Birmingham City find out about a, a North London boy? Um, I think everyone has like obviously their scouting yeah. and stuff like that. And then I had some options when I left Tottenham of places where I could go to and try and stuff like that. So as soon as I'd left, basically, I spent like a few weeks trying in different places and Birmingham was one of the places that was interested in me. Right, OK. Um, and, and you've sort of gone through the age groups yeah. there and, and last season you played quite a lot of games in the under-23s, is that yeah. right? Yeah, I've been going through the age groups there. I've been there obviously four years now. So I've made the natural progression from the under-18s to the under-23s and I've played a lot of games there last season. And I think you played 23 games. Yeah, i played quite a few. Like I got injured near the back end of the season, but apart from that, I played pretty much everyone before that. So right. Yeah. And I think I'm right in saying you're 20 now. Yeah, I've just turned, I'm 20. My birthday's in December, so... you become 21, yeah. Yeah, I'll be 21 in December. Yeah. Right. And uh, who, whose idea was it to come to Woking Football? Um, How did that happen? Um, basically, at my age, it's like a good idea to get out like and play first-team football, and that's what was on the agenda for me. Like I want to play first-team football develop as much as I can this year so between the club and uh, my agent they were looking for somewhere for me to go like a few leagues lower than obviously yeah. Birmingham City where I wasn't getting any yeah. opportunity yet then so we could, like basically develop me so and then Woking came up as a potential place and as soon as I seen it I just jumped out and thought it would be a good opportunity for me. Brilliant and uh, tell us about yourself as a player. What sort of player are you? As a player, I'm like a box-to-box -box midfielder. I would say like I'm good at attacking, but I just I'm good at defending as well, so I can do both. But I'd say my main attributes are probably like creativity and like I enjoy like creating and scoring goals. Yeah. But then I'm willing to do the other side of the ball, off the ball as well. So. And uh, is it right you you're left-sided? Um yeah, I'm left. -footed. Yeah, you are left-footed. Yeah. Right. I can use my right as well sometimes. <laughs> so, how have you found uh, the standard of of the guys who are now your teammates here well, compared no, I, to under twenty three stuff? I think it's a different level, like yeah. going to first team football. Like you can see the intensity, like how vocal the players are. Like it's a different type of situation to what you're used to. It's not like twenty three stuff, and that's what I've come here for basically to understand and to be around that type of environment and the lads have been great and 
understanding and training has been great as well. Like there's a lot of like good talent here and stuff like that. Like it's, it's a very good level. Yeah. Great. And are you you living at home in North London? Um, yeah, I've been doing a bit of both sometimes in accommodation nearer to here. Right. Depending on what's best for yes. the next day. Yeah. And then obviously I can travel. Like today I travelled down from North London. And yeah, a bit of both. Right. And you've scored a goal for us already, haven't you? Oh yeah. In the first first game I scored a, a good goal. I was really happy with that because it was just a good way to get started. That was the third goal against Shearwater, wasn't yeah, it? In yeah, in the second half. Yeah. yeah. Well, it's, it's great to meet you. Thanks very much Thank for giving you. up some time. And we very much look forward to seeing you play. Thank you. I look forward to it too.